In 2008, a mysterious person or group with a pseudonym Satoshi Nakamoto introduced Bitcoin, a decentralized digital currency designed to operate independently of governments and central banks. This peer-to-peer -peer currency allows for direct transactions between users, eliminating the need for intermediaries like banks. Bitcoin's official launch occurred on January 3rd, 2009, with the mining of the first block of transactions, known as the Genesis block. A distinctive feature of Bitcoin is its finite supply, capped at 21 million coins. This scarcity, intended to mimic precious metals and counteract inflation, has been a key factor in Bitcoin's rapid appreciation and widespread adoption. But did you know? In 2010, the first recorded purchase made with Bitcoin was quite a casual one. Two large pizzas from Papa John's. It happened on May 22nd, a day now celebrated as Bitcoin Pizza Day. Back then, a Florida-based software engineer named Laszlo Hanyets offered 10,000 Bitcoins for the pizzas on an online Bitcoin forum. He mentioned, I'll pay 10,000 Bitcoins for a couple of pizzas, like maybe two large ones so I have some left over for the next day, expressing his desire to enjoy the convenience of delivered food in exchange for this new digital currency. Little did he know, those 10,000 Bitcoins would now be worth an incredible $600 million as of writing. Bitcoin's journey since its inception in 2009 has been a roller coaster of price fluctuations and significant milestones. Initially valued at zero, Bitcoin saw its first notable valuation by the end of 2010 at 30 cents. The year 2011 marked a breakthrough as its price surged to an all-time high of $29.60 in June. However, 2012 proved less eventful, with Bitcoin experiencing stagnation. The real momentum picked up in 2013 when its value soared past $1,000 for the first time, marking a historic milestone in the cryptocurrency world. Yet, 2014 brought a severe setback. The Mt. Gox exchange, one of the largest at the time, suffered a devastating hack in February. This cyber attack led to the suspension of all Bitcoin withdrawals and trading on the platform, triggering a prolonged bearish period for Bitcoin and the broader cryptocurrency market in the subsequent years. Bitcoin's resilience was evident in 2017, when it not only recovered, but surged to new heights, reaching $1,000 early in the year and eventually peaking at an astonishing $20,000 by the year's end. However, this meteoric rise was not without its challenges. In 2018, the cryptocurrency faced another setback when CoinCheck, a major exchange, lost $530 million to hackers, impacting market confidence and causing a decline in Bitcoin's value. Despite these hurdles, Bitcoin showed its ability to recover once again in 2019, surpassing the $10,000 mark and demonstrating its ongoing appeal and resilience in the face of adversity. During the pandemic, Bitcoin emerged as a favored investment option, with its value climbing to nearly $30,000 in 2020. The momentum continued into 2021, when Bitcoin soared to a then-record high of $68,000. This surge in popularity was driven by several factors, including its growing acceptance in mainstream financial circles, such as being included in 401k plans and endorsements from influential figures like Tesla CEO Elon Musk. These developments underscored Bitcoin's evolving role as a significant asset class and its increasing integration into traditional financial systems. In 2022, Bitcoin and the broader cryptocurrency market encountered significant challenges that dampened investor sentiment. The year began with a notable event involving the stablecoin TerraUSD and its associated cryptocurrency Luna, which experienced a sharp decline in value, prompting concerns and contributing to a loss of confidence among investors. Later in the year, the collapse of the FTX exchange dealt a severe blow to the crypto market. This event triggered a widespread sell-off leading to what was described as a crypto market bloodbath. Bitcoin in particular saw its value plummet by more than half, dropping to as low as $18,000 amid the turmoil. These incidents showed the volatility and risks inherent in the cryptocurrency ecosystem, impacting prices across various digital assets. After enduring a prolonged bear market, Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies have staged a remarkable comeback. Earlier this year, Bitcoin surged to a new all-time high of $73,000. This bullish momentum can be attributed to several key factors. Firstly, 
The approval of spot Bitcoin ETFs by the SEC in the US provided a significant boost, enhancing accessibility and legitimacy for institutional investors. Secondly, the UK's approval of Bitcoin-linked securities being listed on the stock market further bolstered market confidence and liquidity. Excitement surrounding the recent Bitcoin halving event, which reduced the mining reward by half, has also fueled expectations of supply scarcity and potential price appreciation. These combined factors have created a favorable environment for Bitcoin's resurgence and have contributed to its recent record-breaking performance in the cryptocurrency markets. What about you? What do you envision as the future role of Bitcoin in shaping the future of digital finance? We would love to hear from you. Please share your wonderful thoughts in the comments below. Also, if you found today's video informative and would like to receive more insights and updates on cryptocurrency and global finance, please consider liking the video, subscribing to our channel, and turning on post notifications. Stay tuned for our next episode, where we'll bring you more of the latest updates in crypto and digital finance. Until then, keep questioning, keep exploring, and most importantly, continue to invest wisely. Thank you for watching, and we look forward to seeing you in the next video.